to focus on your show, I'm your host, Linda. If you're new here, please consider clicking the subscription button. And again, if you're new here, let me tell you what this show is all about. It's all about matters that youths love, matters that are that like matters affecting youths, and everything, anything about youths. For those who always come back here to support me and watch my videos, I want to say thank you. I'm so grateful. I'm happy. And thanks for your comments, for the way you share, for your like. Thank you so much. Let's go to our today's topic. Our today's topic is about ladies who go to party at night or to clubs. Or let's say night club without extra cash or without fare. As always, I have my fellow youths with me and let's hear from them and like the advice they have to our fellow youths and everything. I hope you'll enjoy the show. As I told you, I have my fellow youths as the guests today. Two of them are famous faces, but they also have to introduce them to reintroduce themselves because I know we have maybe visitors visiting our YouTube today. And one of one of our fellow youth here is some of our new face. I think I'll give him time to introduce himself. Please kindly introduce yourself. Okay, I'm Moses Omulamu, a student at Sigalaga. Thank you. Yes. Okay, I'm Sharon Nobisa, a Kenyan citizen. I guess I'm diverse in Munyeji. Yeah. Okay, thank you. So as I said, today's topic is about ladies going to club or night party without extra cash, or maybe like I'm invited by a friend, like, oh, let's say this, my friend is invited by maybe the sponsor or the boyfriend, then the friend invites me and we go together. We don't have any extra cash, we don't have any money, then maybe we reach there, my friend, like, got issues with the boyfriend, and maybe we are left stranded. So that's our topic today. And maybe it has happened to one of us here, or maybe to your friends, or you can maybe you can get the story from the internet. You know that you know like it's not something new. So let's start from there. Have you ever had a friend? Or let's start with this. What is your say about people going ladies? Okay, we're basing on ladies. We'll come with another episode of men. What? Okay, what is your take or what is your view with people, ladies going to a night party or a club without extra cash or without even fair? Yeah, the first thing, it depends because mm -hmm. um, if I did invite them, mm -hmm. then I, the one who, who, who has the idea mm -hmm. of the party is the one who is responsible for all the allowances, traveling, mm -hmm. fair, mm -hmm. and even the meal. Mm -hmm. So now it depends because you know you called me mm -hmm. maybe i had, i was not in a position to so it's like something like an invitation mm -hmm. it requires the invite eh? the invite mm -hmm. oh not like we're not one. supposed to come okay okay it's okay maybe you don't invite them is it right for a lady, a lady like to come to your party or maybe to your place the place you invited them to without any extra cash it depends with their state if they had no money to to, to find them. Oh, oh no, my question is, is it advisable for the ladies to go without any cash? Because you know, they can come there, then maybe you have, or let's say an issue comes with you and your girlfriend. Then you like you left them stranded without anything. So to you, is it right for a lady to come to the place that she's invited without any cash? <coughs> Maybe she needs some little emergency <laughs> cash. Was <laughs> <laughs> yeah. bura bura. Yeah, bura bura. Mm -hmm. Just in case uh -huh. things fall apart. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Charlotte Kaba. Okay. Personally, mm -hmm. I won't. I don't have much experience, but mm -hmm. I have friends, mm -hmm. so I will mm -hmm. talk out of my sense. Yeah. <laughs> out of my sense. Mm -hmm. Actually, I think the question should not be: Is it? Is it? right mm -hmm. it, it should be is it safe mm -hmm. how can you hear is it safe for a lady to walk out mm -hmm. to go to a date mm -hmm. or a without club without any cash mm -hmm. or, or emergency fund mm -hmm. anything can happen mm -hmm. you never know these guys we are just 
crying there. <laughs> they are capable of anything. Mm-hmm. You never know. What is is the person making? putting you on the hot spot mm-hmm. is endangering your life. Mm-hmm. You have to run away from it. Mm-hmm. So you don't expect the person who is who intends to rape you to give you fire to run. Mm-hmm. You understand? Mm-hmm. So it is only advisable that you take caution. Mm-hmm. Carry something along with you. Yeah, you don't just don't go, you don't walk anyhow with mm-hmm. you. Yeah, take care of yourself. Have mm-hmm. something. And if you have to go without mm-hmm. eh, any any cash, mm-hmm. I will I think it has to be somebody you really trust so much, or somebody you know is not capable of okay. <coughs> making you okay. You are a student, and maybe you have friends. You are a college, and you are a story major. Can you tell us, is it advisable for a lady to go out of there without extra cash or without any cash? Because like I'm a court invited. For me, it's not safe because you know we do with the let me say the for security purposes, mm-hmm. it's not safe. So you have to carry your cash. Mm-hmm. You have to go there with your cash. Mm-hmm. Something might happen. It's true. <laughs> yeah, many things happen. Mm-hmm. You know, Muneza kwa di club and maybe that guy is a is a drunkard, akunyo mm-hmm. zimushike and so on. Akosa kulipa bill and you are there. When we spent in the air, they have seen you with the, with the man or with the guy. So I, I, it's not safe. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, next. Let's now go to, it's just the same thing. All of you have said that it's not safe for a lady to go out there without extra cash or any cash. Please, ladies, if you're going out there, even if you're invited by, even if it's someone you trust, please make sure you have... Even just to fair, so that if anything happens, at least you can cut up on your fare and you get home safely. Let's now go to ladies who go to party or to club. And like, they want to eat expensive food, they want to drink expensive drinks, and they know that they're, like, they're depending on the guy. Like, you don't have the cash there, like you do, and you want to eat. If like your bill comes, it's almost fifty thousand, and you're depending on the guy that love them is a person anytime. <clears throat> Let's discuss about this issue. Why should ladies go there and they eat almost over fifty thousand, and they know they have zero balance, like they have nothing, they have nothing with them. Why should those ladies like or us ladies eat more than what we can afford? Because it's someone paying, even if that person is like prominent or rich, why should you endanger your life? So I don't know if it's we are like we'll discuss it as a, no, the advice will come later. Let's start from there. How do you see this issue of ladies going out there and eating like the bill was almost fifty thousand, and like they have nothing, they're depending like on you to pay it. And imagine right. the bill is fifty thousand. Yeah, you will desire yeah, so, uh, the, the the beginning mm-hmm. when I say ma me come and make invite. Mm-hmm. Then I'm responsible to pay. Mm-hmm. So nili wapeleka kwa hoteli ni kiangalia mfuko wangu hivi mimi sitajiangisha. Yeah. But so, you know, some ladies are just like sijui nasema aje like they're extreme mimi sijui nitatumia tani gani because you know utakuja kula ta bill 100 tu. Yeah, si wewe ndio uliwaita. So and like you don't know the people invite. So for, for <laughs> the guys who invite ladies there, make sure you pay the bills. Yeah, you know the people. Ah, yeah. Invite. Tunataka to assume. Uh-huh. Let's assume this. Mrambako amekuja na na rende yake watu wengi, si ndio? Mkakuwa na issue na mrambako mkakosa. Are you going to still pay the bills? If I called them, then I have to pay. Now, you invited your own lady. <laughs> na akakuja na <laughs> na rafiki zake. You see? Alafu yeah. pale, the bill is almost let's say 200,000. Na are you still going to pay the bill? Because it depends on how you are going to pay For me, because I'm, I'm, I'm the one who called you guys, mm-hmm. it's a pain to embarrass one. Mm-hmm. So I just need to stand in, mm-hmm. cover the situation. Because mm-hmm. money comes, money goes. Mm-hmm. So come and you I will be. Because I'm going to be able to do it. So, mm-hmm. 
but ladies will make sure like kwa kule kitu naweza afford right in case of anything <laughs> let's just say okay you, for you you will pay for another guy let's say mose ya yeah, maybe mose atakasirika sio mimi sibiti like should ladies eat what they can afford or they should just go there and eat 500 just dollars. eat what is enough for you mm-hmm. yeah okay charot kwa hapa linda sincerely speaking mm-hmm. I don't understand how somebody can eat 100,000 in a night. <laughs> But I don't I'm not saying that it's not possible. It is possible because some of these guys are like you invite them for dinner or something mm-hmm. and then they're like, "Oh, tunaenda kumkunywa leo." Mm-hmm. So like they're out to extort you. Mm-hmm. So it doesn't matter what they eat or what how much it is. Mm-hmm. Kama watashika yeah. mwake ama watashika in fact our kulangi are huh? just people who are just this extravagant people mm-hmm. who relate what they do not know with the class mm-hmm. because by the time i'm ordering a food that is worth 50k mm-hmm. that I, i'm very and, and uh, in some cases i'm not even sure what the kind of food it mm-hmm. is mm-hmm. you know i'm i'm associating my ignorance with mm-hmm. the class which is stupidity mm-hmm. so mm-hmm. most girls think that it's wise mm-hmm. it's, it's 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 healthy it's whatever they can call it mm-hmm. but to me personally if i go out for a date linda with mm-hmm. somebody even if it was an invitation mm-hmm. i'm a more to okay the channel i'm taking you out to eat mm-hmm. and it's it's on me <coughs> honestly speaking i will not eat anything that is beyond what is in my pocket <laughs> Do you think that ladies should just order like expensive food, expensive drinks? Na like kwa pocketia wanajua ukweli kabisa hata pesa ziko nayo fiki 500 shillings. But hata vitu vyamo kula ni 50,000. Is it right? Hai, bangu mimi hiyo si right. Nikitalingana <laughs> you know mm. umeita ume umeita nini tuseme demu yako amekuja mm-hmm. na amekuja na friends mm-hmm. unajua emia wengi na kuanga ni twende tumunyonye hizo nini ni vimelea <laughs> wanakuja na vimelea ya wenzao do so they na vote kula pia unaangalia na bill you know even unaangalia pia huyu ni mtu so unaangalia bill venye wao na spend and You mean to say matupo security purposes mm-hmm. spend pesa zenye unajua hata kiumana wewe unaweza kuuliza I think some guys should guys mm-hmm. should also be aware of who they are talking out mm-hmm. because you invite me mm-hmm. and you are like some pride is talking mm-hmm. so now that's a man talking mm-hmm. I like Sharon how much can you eat Really? <laughs> uh-huh. I'm taking you for lunch mm-hmm. and you're going to eat anything you want because I'm very sure you can't eat anything that mm-hmm. is beyond my pocket. Mm-hmm. You see that like yeah, I, there's nothing you can eat that is beyond my pocket. Mm-hmm. I'm taking you for lunch and you're going to eat a food of your choice. Mm-hmm. My friend beware. Beware if there is a menu in that hotel mm-hmm. that is carrying food that is worth 10,000 and above. A lady will pick it. She will deliberately pick it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So just pride to, pia. Yeah, just to hurt your ego. Mm-hmm. Or maybe <coughs> see how much you are really willing to mm-hmm. pay her bills. Mm-hmm. So if you are if you're sure if 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 you don't have that amount of money in your pocket, wanaume pia tusijichoche sana. It's not right. Mm-hmm. Same like yeah, and then you are taking me to a, a five star hotel. And you think I can, I will need something of 1500 mm-hmm. or or 2 mm-hmm. you see that but when I come to Sharov to attend can I just come okay that was mm-hmm. not me mm-hmm. but I was talking about somebody who's in the shoes and not pure mm-hmm. yeah so you have to be aware mm-hmm. <laughs> Sichakula kitija tuna confirm hapo tunaangalia kwa hiyo menu. Haujai kula kwa hoteli bili ikakushtua like na wako kwenye mmoja amekuja mara fika zake karibu 6. Hiyo bili drink mmoja ni 15k, mwingine 15k, mwingine 15k. Na different before you order I confirm. 
Oh, will you believe me? Before you order. Before you order. You have to confirm. Before those ladies order, you have to confirm. Yeah, you have to confirm. Because when you are broke, when you are not going to confirm. Okay, when you are... Okay, let us be sensible, guys. When you take me out, and then you want to look through the menu and tell me what I should order. Now, really, is that really making sense? But you know, okay, as a man, Ukana kama una by the way let me see this usijichoche usijichoche ambia tu mtu linda kula chakula na ipiti 3000 yeah unaelewa so that at least atakuwa anajua ina 5 ticket 3000 and below yeah. then pia ladies ebu kwanza turudishe tena kama question is it right for a lady una invite date na beba wa juku wangu tunakuja wote mara kitu inalingana na the type of date na Ah uri ni vitu mwenyewe. Labda nimekuja mara kwa karibu 8. Labda umejipanga toka kwa kati yako. Labda unakuja nao 8 unajua ndio sawa sawa. Sawa utalipa tade miaka au gradi sawa. Kama umejipanga 8 umejipanga. Yeye umejipanga. So so we have hotel potade miaka ngino ajipange. Yeah, unajipia mtu alikuwa kwa agenda. Okay, Linda let me say something. Ladies, ladies, it's still ladies. Like tukuwe too sensible. Son of a, a man mm-hmm. somewhere has invited you for a date, mm-hmm. a dinner date, mm-hmm. a date, not a get together, <laughs> not, a family yeah, chama. not a family gathering, not chama. Mm-hmm. Just go by yourself. Like, is it really sensible to carry your netball team uh-huh. along with you? It's not. <laughs> and even those who get invited and go along. Mm-hmm. I think you are you are senses are not working right. Mm-hmm. Because somebody will not come and tell me Sharon like my my boyfriend is is taking me out on Let's a date mm-hmm. and I want you to accompany me. Okay. There are these instances that I can mm-hmm. I can add, I can add, I can say it's admissible. Yeah, maybe you, maybe you don't feel safe. Yeah, like this this all like dating mm-hmm. and then it's the first date mm-hmm. and then you don't know this guy. Mm-hmm. You need security. Mm-hmm. So you will tell that guy in advance oh I'm coming with my friend. My friend, mm-hmm. not not a football team. Even in that case, not a football team. Mm-hmm. You will, if you need a football team, you go and you go take your date in a public, a public place. Mm-hmm. So you have cheers, you have fans. Mm-hmm. You have fans. <laughs> so that you are safe. But for personal mm-hmm. security, mm-hmm. you have that one person. Mm-hmm. You no, know, mm-hmm. uh, if anything happens, then. We, we are we can fight yeah. Yeah. 10 so, friends yeah please don't go ahead and carry and get together for your boyfriend mm-hmm. or not it, it it is it is infringing privacy of that guy mm-hmm. because this is maybe a day that this guy plans to pay me something special yeah well may carry you are you are yeah, team. but but it also yeah. depends mm-hmm. eh? love that this man has the capacity Even so, it is For example, when I'm Linda, we're going for coffee tomorrow, or we're going maybe for a glass of wine tomorrow. Who can Linda? Tell your friends we are going. We are going for this and this and this. Unaelewa? Unaweza kuja na wapi Oh my God! How many times have I said it? It depends. It depends. As you want to focus, we let them. We need to let them know that. As in, 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 in a linga, na unajua sometimes we need to go and talk with the man to talk about his feeling insecure. Just invite one. Just one person. One friend is just enough. Unataka kubeba na friends. What if you bump into others? Why you tell you? Ah, siyo kutania uko. Siyo kutania uko. Ah, 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 siyo kutania uko. No, hakuna shida. Hakuna shida na tokanga kama like mimi beb. I'm dating this guy. Maybe anafanya kazi somewhere. I think ni zito. And then I want to show him off. And all that stuff. And I'm like, you guys, you normally say that your boyfriends have that and that. Come and see me. But yeah, that is a stupid But you know, you okay, but okay ladies. Okay, my advice to you ladies. The only thing that your friends should know about your boyfriend is only the name. Gina to pack yake yes. Yes. No, it's not being mean. Yeah. Why should your friends know more about your boyfriend? Why should they not know more about me? Why? 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 No, 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 no. No, 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 no,
mm-hmm. if you hide the face and many things mm-hmm. then utakuja ku realize later maybe hakuna the face different. okay you know, no, you are, there's no me. problem but them no akutana na wewe who launch in the death scene but like your friends will not know no more about it but That is according to girls perspective. Yeah. But we, we are free. Let them let them introduce us to the old one.
probably I think you guys normally misunderstand the terms friendship. <coughs> we have access to people and we have friends. Yeah, those are two different things. There are people you normally talk to, you can even stay with with them, but they are not yet friends, they are just associates. Yeah, and now we have friends in Walu and Kadit. Walu and Yunajua, Kupa Kupona, they are there. No, 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 come up. So that's what I have some of them for your friends who know only the name of your man. What's that for me? What is the advice you can give to, to ladies out there who goes to club or party? without any cash. What is the genuine advice you'll give to them? Most of you are the the youth. What is the advice you'll give to them? What is the advice for ladies that could advice for men before to wrap up What is the advice you can give to those ladies when you work your muka too? Apart from what uh one in the club without pesa. Wanna be banana what we win one in the club. Like you can invite 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 you what is the advice you can give to them? Hey, to ladies, when you are a man of a best, you are a man of 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 a man so budget ni kila mahali kila sector inakuwa upige budget so wewe ukikuja kama unajua ujiwezi mwambie ajue sio kubebana na watu unakuja wana na, na labda jamaa budget yake ilikuwa limited so hata hapo stranded ajui venye atafanya so make sure una at least uko na kitu ama umemwambia Girls, girls, there's no amount of food that can define your class. Tumbo ni tumbo. Chakula ni chakula. Once you are not allergic to eat, eat. Seriously, what is this eating Spanish? What, what, what? Ata nyata ujiji. Ata ujiji. Ata ujiji. Ata kuendo mujai. Pika chakula kama iyo. Kwa 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 Stop attaching your 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 class to these simple things. I don't know the dimension. Of mm. I don't know the But I normally hear what when you are not to be on a when a jigamba when you are going to be on a jigamba when you are going to be on a jigamba when you are going to an important person, a relevant person of the society, a relevant citizen. <laughs> Food has nothing to do with your class. Stop. It is an illusion. If you think you are going out there to eat Spanish, what I don't know. <laughs> and then you are going to show this guy that you have class. Mm -hmm. No, you don't have class. Unaeza oda kitchen wizi kula, unaeza oda snacks. You eat snacks so just in the name watch. of you want to show your class, you know. So being ignorant, moving around with the boss, with the boss, with the so you feel so relevant it doesn't make in fact if you want to show yourself to me that you are relevant i despise you because 
It's not because it's, it's something that I don't do. I despise it because I don't. But I don't see any sense in it. Yeah, it doesn't make you better person. Drinking mzinga does not make you better person. So usi usi wende uku uve mtoto wenye bili ya ujinga ni eh ni unataka kunywa mzinga ya ujinga. What are you so? Who are sensible? You might just lose a, a potential husband just because you end up with twenty thousand. Do you know that? <laughs> because some of these guys just want to know how ma- how well you can manage finances, yeah. and then he goes ahead and <laughs> and realizes that one night. Yeah, that in one night you have just spent fifty thousand. But what is fifty thousand? Now where we spend? Ebungoja. Ebungoja, what is fifty thousand? Okay, to Narudi Airport. What is fifty thousand? In a night, we may spend fifty thousand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are not going to spend fifty thousand. We are just 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 going to spend fifty thousand. Wasana nabidi apo amabaki wamata beti zao wamata masimu zao mbona wanachanga bili 50000 is not money labda ulichoma sina na sema sio kama ni chamo sio ni chamo una wewe 50000 is not money mbona usilipe mbona waache kama mmekofana wako unawaache alafu alafu by the way i don't the reason why i don't feel sense in the world si kwa ubaya Unaishi kwa single room ya 4000 unaenda kukunywa drink ya 12 do you have sex Do you have sense? Do you really have sense? There's a way you can get to that guy. Priorities. Yeah, without... Why are you criticizing this? We are not criticizing. So we are just saying the truth. Man. <coughs> Let me say Jama, the truth. So now, it's a little bit. It feels like he has a lot. I will forget. Yeah. should i spend 50000 and make you for bed sitter yeah you know you know the first thing as a man i have a budget mm-hmm. and i have an aim mm-hmm. whatever i do i have budget mm-hmm. so kama nilikuwa nime budget na niko na aim ya plan huyu msichana pia mimi sitaki kuchoma sisi mimi sitaki kujua wewe unajua tumekutana kwa barabara labda mimi sijai kuja kwa hapo nijue kama una card sitter so i know unajua what you talking about before and you call like a kukata we are like is it right for those ladies like you gonna struggle financially and you gonna collect it you know come to buy for the 500 no so dear 45 let me tell you this by the way morality hakuna vile uta spend kama mike ya this song ya tupa tupa a man can spend buy you crate of beer but always kununulia a small packet of flour you can't buy someone a made maize flower and you can buy like 50000 drink yeah i can not spoil you to buy it it also applies to a lady yeah yeah but you can buy you any What advice can you give to ladies? Yeah, that, so that is the objective or the, the main aim of why we shall do so. So the advice eh, to ladies eh, um I think probably you know getting getting uh, getting we do many things out of excitement and fear defines our life many of us. So wakati unapata ile opportunity ya kupata kitu you know you always have long hopes ya kwamba pia kesho hizi vitu bado kwa provided and you know most of the time we use your short side kitambo tufunguke macho eh tuko 50 na watu hawatutaki 35 no good one as again so uh, probably just live a good life 
um, if you have an opportunity to eat, eat decently. Yeah, unaweza itisha hizo Chinese food, what, what, just eat. If you, maybe that is the only opportunity you have ever taste such milk, okay. not bad. But should they, should they like order expensive food and they have a the security the security of a woman is a man beside him. That is how it works. There is if there is no man around, that lady won't even eat. He'll take water. Yeah? Okay, so what is your advice to them? Yeah. When you are out villa anything, yeah, perhaps because of those emergencies in your Nasema, those Jacobaliana Nazo Sana, for the sake of the emergencies, you are uh, encouraged to carry something small. But then in Alingana, come on, Nenda Malikama Dubai, by the way, it's a better place. I hope you know Malikama Nairobi out. You know, when you know, 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 you Ugwame mali papulalo, ugwame kuchakula, ugwame kuchakula. Whatever happens, usikose fea. My dear, you say me tu hivu bad. Mep, ataka mba, ataka mba, ataka mba, ataka mba, mep, soli mchape inatosha tunanienda. Usikule mbea, mama. Usikose fea, ya. Ya, 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 like, really, because this security, like the one is saying, can turn to be insecurity. What if it's the insecurity? We, we don't budget for emergencies. For an emergencies come, then we handle them. No, but fair. You want to trust them? Okay. Okay. You are fair. Diapers. 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 Oh, damn. I, will, I want to give you a scenario. You want to make a dream out. I'm a kukula and I'm a kukula. You're not going to be 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 a kukula. Um, when you eat a man's money, <laughs> wonder the case. Mm. Of course, he's, he's already having expectations. Mm -hmm. To see me see your point, but then you kulipa your hundred k, and you know how to pay. Manaja kulipa na kanya ni. Okay, now it's time for you to make a pay mm -hmm. the hundred k, and then she's not comfortable with you getting the payment, mm -hmm. and then mm -hmm. you mm -hmm. want mm -hmm. okay, you want the payment mm -hmm. whichever way. You guys have gone to a private place. You want to get on to her. Mm -hmm. <coughs> now she had nothing. Mm -hmm. Do you think she's safe? Okay. You know, you know, you know, you know, okay. you know. Maybe you okay. had an expectation. Yeah, okay, you ask. Like a lady, kwa handi bagu, si bebe tu pia makeup. There are these tools. Unaenda bebe pilipili, zindano. Ikikuwa mbaya, unadunga mtu macho. Matapo, kile mtu. Wewe, wewe. Wewe, wewe. Wewe, wewe. Wewe, wewe. Wewe, wewe. Security. Si bebe pilipili. Usi bebe, usi bebe phones. Na nini kwa nini. Kwa kwa bagu. Pilipili, zindano. Usikuse hizo staff. Ikikuwa mbaya, jitetea. Ya, jitetea. Defend yourself. Jitetea. So, hame jitetea. Nana fea, shuwali. Nini, no? Unakwanda unakwanda? Unakwanda kwenye tapapa kwa understand? Wewe, kauta peleka deni yako out, wanda kutani mwaza ni 20k. Those people, wenye wanapeleka, wanapeleka madiemu out kutani mwaza ni 20k. Sana sana na sponsors. Na inakwanda kwa budget. Na kwanga sponsor. Na unafikanga huko, wana kwa sana. Wana wachia madem B. Ndiyo maana wengine wana wawu wa. Eee, wana wachia madem B. Madem C. Ama tuseme unenda kwa, kwa, ito aze kwa guest room. Ama wachia the lodge. Alapo mbefika huko kwa lodge, msena atake kukota ri. Sabi nina sanga aluwa wa kwa club. Na zipia wa mzijana wendi wa kwa nakida. So you know, you know, you know, you know. What am I spending on air? What am I spending on? And why am I spending first of all? Mm. I have an objective that has to be met. Yeah. Any any other company we invest in, we do not have any car. We do not have any. When we tend to invest, we have no money. We tend to have a couple of pesos. We have no money. 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 Must for near water. When you're playing a madam, you go out. A lot of people come out. When I watch, I need to like maybe cut off an argument. When I need to pangalian, be like anything. Aya. 
now let's go to the advice work from our gentleman up here wa baba has na sponsor so na sponsor wenye wanapeleka sana hiyo club alafu na chamisha mtoto okay to my fellow men outside there the only advice i can give you men you know you are very wise so be sober and be human Yeah, that is all. Be sober and be human. Be sober and be human. There are so many and also be human. Unajua msichana pia anaweza tukuvudi. Unajua anaweza kuwa tu guide plan pia yeye. You know, you always find guide. Magaidi msiendage huko hapo. Tumeona mtatamizi. Haya. Sera toka hapa ndi. Au baba, wa baba. Au there. I want to speak to you. Like it's really sad to take somebody's child out then you leave her to wash his dentures. In a very big hotel serving 10,000 people to her. Kwa tu mtu. Hata kama amekubo, at least pay bill, ajitegemee from there. Mm. And then another thing. You guys like wa baba zenye wana fund, you make somebody eat. You make somebody comfortable eat 20,000. <laughs> and then and then later unataka uko na expectation sure on that very night labda atako juu no i should i not expect labda ako juu labda ako juu mbona ako juu eh eh you invite me for a drink it doesn't matter whether niko juu or niko chini sio linda come and invite for a drink mimi nikuja tu kukula alafu najua sina expectation najua nakula na rudi kwa nyumba rudi kwa nyumba then you you want me to eat 50000 comfortable na yeye pesa na watu Nani ko juu I can't pay the money. Darudi tu chini. Hapana nataka tu mke kule pesa yako. Mpe tu rosa. I I think I think Ah mama mama you are coming for dinner date and after dinner there is this and this and this. Yeah make it clear. Make it clear what they do. They don't make it that Somebody will tell you where are you at least I'm I'm just coming from work. Mm-hmm. Oh, can I pick you? Mm-hmm. And you're like pick me to where? Okay, we can go and hang out in a club. Mm-hmm. Yeah, just for some few minutes. I may say a few minutes. This guy wants you to spend hours. Eat 50,000 then you pay. It doesn't it's not fair. See a fair. Um, you see we can't get my nails while it's Mzo ni nini? Mtu ametangaza sema kutaka anaenda huko anaanza kupil nini? Yetu aje waruhu kwa chetu kwa sababu watu umwamwachia. Bona mnapenda vitu vya bure. It's not it's not vitu bure. Wewe ni uli 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 uli. Sio ukuje tu fund pia wewe hiyo kitu. Ah kuna atakufund. Mimi mimi siko kuita. You know you know you guys are I have been having that idea of No, wacha nikwambie. Tenda equality. At least tenda equality. Mimi naweza kukuita nikwambie kama tuna over the best friend yangu nikwambie. Let's go for coffee. Mimi mwenye msema let's go for coffee. Najua mimi mfuko wangu naweza fika coffee. Mimi wana nitoa na mbeto ile drink alafu na tunaoka five star hotels hiyo home and 20000. Okay. Hata coffee hiyo siwezi afford. Serious. Sasa unataka sana baada nini? Eh. And then alafu unakasirika. Sasa nakula kwa kibanda huko kule kaka. Alafu eh nina za afford. Ananipeleka huko alafu anakasirika tena. Imagine. Si poa. Sasa usonge sema wewe wote ukisema hata uko black mimi nika bila kwa kibanda kwa kibanda huko. Nikule katakata turudi. Lakini akisemi katakata. What is this humiliation you are talking about? You know, when you come to a five star hotel, bill you have to pay 20,000. Lapo bado unataka nilipe peke yangu. Tumekuwa sana, tumekuwa na issue, unataka nilipe bill. Aje sasa. Si unabeba mzigo wako sasa. Nani alipeleka hapo? Nani alipeleka hapo? Eh, well, mose yeye alijana na mazo mose. Mose tuka hapa. What is the advice you can give to your fellow gentlemen? Je, ama wale wa baba wangu kwa ma sponsors? Yeah, to men. Ni nachamisha madeni yetu huko. To men kama wewe ujidana. Sort to your manager. Good. Na kwa sort. Sort to. Do, unajua men sema tukikatia madem tunawafanyanga pia wao wakwena. Labda 
labda gentleman ulienda ukatiana na ATM so huyu anajua huyu huyu msako na do huyu na umempeleka five star hotel yes hata kwa wazimu wa kule na anajua wewe ndo mwenye umempeleka huko anajua wewe ndo mwenye ulimuita so ukimwacha i make sense then okay. yeah you have inafaa usort hiyo bill awezi tu muita na kumwacha hey, it, it is a mchango <laughs> but you cannot discuss discard a useful project something very valuable you cannot just leave it so hiyo ni uti zote kuna bottle available wote nikwambia tu una legal sense unaona nini do you know unaweza pelika mtu club unaona masikana karibu 50k na argument kuje na argument ukishakuja utaenda ukasaka mbona unataka kulipa bill kama uko na na wewe mbona unachochea hiyo argument si si sasa unachochea argument argument hapa na theological it happens but mtu anaweza pita mtu anaweza pita kuja kwa demo yako ukasema unajua bill unaambia demo yako namba wewe unaona kitu kama hiyo unaona ni like kuna sema tu na kasirikanga tu ama umeangalia tu mtu kijana tu ameenda gym umeangalia jamani kasirika ama kasirika yeye ni baba kitabu ndio yule mbona uangalie unaangalia sasa kijana wa mtu ameenda gym amejaa umeangalia honestly honest na baba yako kitambi jana amefika kwa honest looking yani ile honest looking just honest glimpse you are stealing a glimpse jamaa amekasirika na kuacha na bill si fair si fair nyinyi hamtaki kitu hicho tunaangalia No, I just want to example argument zingine. So, tutajia hapo kwa leo. Next next episode will be about men going to club without cash or maybe wanatanga tanga kwa matibo, wakiwambomba pombe. And I think to wrap up hapo kwa leo. Thank you for watching. Thank you for always tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment and share with your friends. Thank you and see you on our next show.